What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we are doing another episode of WTF is, WTF is This TCG. It's been super long since we've done one of these episodes, uh, so we're actually going to be opening up another box of the DBZ um, TCG Destroyer Kings. Um, yeah, it's been a while, and we actually opened one of these, but uh, for future episodes, I do want to hear from you guys uh, what it is that you would like to see next, and just to throw out some options and make some room, we still have a bunch of Force of Will stuff. We bought, I, I went to a comic book store and bought a lot of random packs of random things. We got these kind of like joke things, uh, silly CDs. We got some random Power Rangers Series 2 stuff. Uh, Marvel's Fantastic First Covers. I don't know anything about any of this. National Lampoon. No idea what's in there. <laughs> so if any of these strike your fancy, let me know in a comment down below. And we'll kind of use that information to figure out what we do next for this series. Uh, a couple other things that we do have is Argent Saga, new TCG that just dropped. Uh, I couldn't find it, but we have another box of Vanguard Card Fight Primary Melody. And, uh, oh, I did mention that for so well. So let me know in a comment down below what it is that you're interested in seeing. And, um, yeah, so while I get this box open, um, thanks again to all everyone that's been supporting the channel, especially those people that have been supporting me for a long, long time. Uh, I've been getting some really awesome comments like, oh, man, it's great to see the channel grow. You know, I found, found it when, like, it was still at, like, 100 or 200 subs. And, you know, I think it's... I want to say a special thank you to all those individuals. You know, it's that long-term support, that grassroots kind of support that, you know, makes everything possible. You know, without without those people, without those individuals, like maybe this channel would have ended a long time ago. So, ooh, I forgot there's a, we also have this dash pack and I get a little confused about what this exactly is because each box does come with a promo as well. So we have the SS Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta and it comes with two dash packs, so we'll open one today and one in the next episode. But uh, and a quick reminder that we do are running a giveaway right now for Pokemon. We're gonna give away a Hidden Fates collection box this Friday. And um, so if you haven't entered already, uh, there's a video that we put out on Sunday, and you'll probably be able to find the title says like giveaway go start or something like that. So definitely go enter if you not have yet to enter already. So we got 12 packs of this DBZ Destroyer King set. And actually, let's open this up, this dash pack first. <clears throat> uh, so one reason I haven't done this episode yet was uh, I felt like a lot of the cards I wasn't familiar with the... Um, not not I wasn't familiar with the characters, but I didn't know all the side stories, especially when it comes to Dragon Ball Super. I feel like I have a general idea of the the entire story but not a lot of the details so I told myself let me brush up on that before I open up this next box but <laughs> I was not able to do that and we Shenron wishing anew I feel like this card is yo it is textured so that does look quite nice as far as what is good what is not I'm not sure but there is a brawly card like agent ultimate agent of destruction that is super valuable still and these boxes, I feel like the prices come down quite a bit from, I think it was like 70s for a while. And then it's kind of dropped off maybe with the new set, this Saiyan Assault or something. All right, let's get into this. And uh, all right, let's get into, all right, let's see. We have a Harmonic Energy SSB Vegeta. Paragus, Father of the Demon. A Impenetrable Defense Trunks, Wrathful Charge. Preemptive Strike, Super Saiyan God. Vegeta, ties that bind Ba, Her Gokule, <laughs> must be a fusion between Hercule and Goku, new model scouter, Yamcha ready to brawl, Vegeta, space pirate Bido, and then, alright, so seems like the card is in the back, and this one is an SR, very nice, Super Shenron, Ultimate Wishmaster, that looks very cool. And actually, we'll probably go through some of the packs a little bit quicker. Uh, so instead of talking about the Dragon Ball Super show, we're going to talk about something else Dragon Ball related, and that is the DBZ Fighters arcade or fighting game. That is something that I do follow very closely. That scene, um, I love watching those tournaments. And uh, 
So if you're into fighting games and have not watched it, I definitely recommend you check it out. Um, the matches take a little bit longer compared to most other games, but I feel like there's some really cool rivalries going on in that scene. We got a Super Saiyan God Goku. Is that all you got? Krillin! Dabura. Alright, Trunks, Dragon Ball. Ah, Master Roshi. Oh gosh, I thought that was <laughs> thought that was the uh, Agent of Destruction. Is that Agent of Destruction? Uh, Ultimate Agent of Destruction. I thought we just pulled it, but it was Limits Transcended. But another SR card. That one looks amazing as well. But, and for people that do follow the DBZ uh, fighters scene, the player that I love, the one I always root for, is Goichi. <laughs> Alright, let's see, we got Pragus, Goku, Kid Goku, ah, and GT Goku, Good Times Goku just got added to the game, and they think they just announced uh, John and Ba, and uh, so I'm super excited to see him. Let's see, we got Gohan, Prepping the Fusion. Hercule, Vegeta, Merciless Farewell, some of the androids, Barry Blue, and then, oh my gosh, another one! Whoa, what is this? SPR, look at that card, looks amazing! Another awesome Brawly card, and I every single time I see this big, huge green haired dude, I keep thinking, oh my gosh, did we get it? But it is Brawly the Transit, this is super textured, look at that. That's really cool how they kind of, I'm not sure what they're called, but just like another picture of him, in the, but the coloring scheme is completely different. So we did get a SPR card, Brawly, Limits Transcended, awesome. Yeah, hey, we haven't, this, uh, it's very front loaded. <laughs> um, so yeah, I absolutely love watching those tournaments. Let's see, I, my go-to guy is Goichi. I feel like he is one of the best arguably the best he's been winning all the tournaments in 2019 and has the like as far as rivalries goes in like I don't know any kind of game I think this is one of my favorites between him and Sonic Fox um, Sonic Fox being maybe arguably like the most successful American player we got a quick shift Krillin and this is actually not the last card so this one is a oh uncommon foil I forgot about that and then a Majin Buu. Just gonna give it a second. <laughs> There's a emergency vehicle. And intensifying evil. So I'm pretty sure I didn't miss anything. Maybe if you get the SR or the SPR, there's actually no foil common or uncommon. But versus if you do get rare, you do get that. But uh yeah, in, in DBZ fighters there's a good amount of um American players, and then a healthy amount of Japanese players. Um, so it's a pretty diverse scene, and an absolute pleasure to watch. So I definitely recommend checking out those tournaments if you've never seen it. You got Energy Barrage Frieza, and okay, so I was wrong. This oh a DR, still not sure what a DR card is, but I feel like there's usually like this red um, Destroyer Rare or something. Oh, Destruction Rare. So we got Lord Slug. This guy's going back here. And put this Shatterfoil guy over here. Uh, but yeah, back to that rivalry between Sonic Fox and Goichi. Um, you know, I feel like there's... Actually, Sonic Fox is a pretty awesome guy as well. Uh, sometimes I forget that how many... like He plays a bunch of different games and he's like, you know, winning, going second place in a bunch of them. Uh, so I was like, oh, okay, so Goichi beat him again. I was like, oh, yeah, but he casually just won, like, the Mortal Kombat <laughs> tournament as well. Um, so a multi, you know, multi-talented player. And here we have a uncommon Paragus. Speedy Entrance Chilai. Don't know who that is. <laughs> Uh, one really cool, like the, yeah, Sonic Fox, Goichi, they face to get each other all the time and like not just respect between amongst each other, but I feel like, you know, they just really enjoy playing each other during the tournament. I think the last tournament, I think it was CEO. 
sometimes I get the tournaments messed up. But uh, they said that before the tournament started, when they were just arriving, um, I think they said like Sonic Fox built his team around entirely to beat Goichi. And before the tournament starts, like they just like warm up together and face off. Uh, so, you know, while they're super competitive, but like at the end of the day, like, you know, to them, they're still playing a game and they're not, they're not going to like hide their tech from each other. So if you're like, uh, oh, I'm guessing this is a Shatter 4 rare. That's why there's no uh, rare in the pack. I thought that was really cool. And I feel like they do a lot of funny stuff between, before, between matches too. Like Goichi has this very interesting habit. I'm not sure what to call it, but a way to, I think he tweeted that this helps with concentration and reaction time where he just flips through this book and maybe he's just trying to read as many words as he can while he's flipping through. So like this, they say speed reading, but uh, you know, doing that can help with reaction time, I guess. So it's really funny. And then whoever he's facing will just try to like read along with them. We got Kikono, the fledgling, that is a uncommon. And Space Pirate Bojack. Pretty sure we pulled a bunch of these. Four. Like that. And in a different tournament, this was a while back, but he would like, I, don't, I think they're like mints or something, or just like pop some mints and then like the commentators kept uh, making jokes that there was uh, sensu beans. That, that was hilarious. Alright, on to the next one. We got Krillin. Ooh, Majin Buu. He was a pretty cool boss. Um, although I think I liked Cell a little bit better. My Saiyan Duo Vegeta. Trunks, Dawn of Evil, Beerus, Yamcha, Training Buddy Krillin. Yeah, so I'm not entirely caught up with the most recent shows, but uh, I mean, does Cell ever come back? I mean, how many times have they defeated Frieza and then Frieza's helping them in that tournament? Um, let's see, who else have they fought many times? How many times have they fought Brawly? <laughs> Even Bardock? Here's Golden Frieza, and then even like Cooler too. But I feel like there was only like one Cell Saga. Boo kind of came back as Ooh for a little bit. Uh, Master Roshi, Dabura, Weiss, and then Four Star Ball for a foil, foil rare. Very nice. All right, we only got two packs remaining. So uh, yeah, definitely let me know what it is you want to see in the next episode of WFTCG. Um, even if it's not, none of those ones I did talk about, you know, if there's a different TCG uh, that's out there and you think it's a good idea, let me know. Uh, a couple of people have mentioned different ones that kind of, I don't know, I took a look at, but then I, I have to say I wasn't that interested in it. But if there's something out there, let me know. We got Boo Boo Volleyball Gotenks, that's uh, his level three attack in the game and then Veku uh, Veku oh that's when uh, Goku and Vegeta fail to fuse together all right on to our last pack I'm not sure what the pull rates are per box but potentially we got our SPR and it might be one of those per box but you never know and let's see we got Goku that looks like Super Saiyan 3 and Jula hmm who are you? Ah, GT Goku. I'm not sure if this was always a thing, but they called him Good Times Goku. I thought that was hilarious. Sun Goku. Uh, Gohan. Another Goku. Hercule. Fount of Spirit. Merciless Strike. And oh my gosh, we keep pulling so many brawlies. And he's not the one we're looking for, but. Alright, we got another SR Golly Brawly. Supreme Berserker, and uh, so that was it for the last pack. Let's do a quick summary. Let's do it like that. We got a Destruction Rare of Lord Slug. Don't know who Lord Slug is, but I think this is like one of the modern people. Brawly Supreme Berserker. Super Shenron. Limits Transcended Brawly, and another one. But this one is the SPR. I have to say that looks amazing. Don't know much about this game or you know how competitive it is, but they do a good job with the cards. Card stock is very nice. And I love that. Love that attention to detail. Uh, 
So that's it for this episode of WTF Is This TCG. Once again, huge thank you to everyone that supports this channel and helped us get to where we are today. Recently broke 500, and uh, if you haven't entered in that Hit of Eights giveaway, make sure you do so. Um, and uh, yeah, let me know if there's anything specific you would like to see in the next episode of this series. And uh, that's it. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.